ça. Move. Move. Say it on your news. But Will you get on your news? You had the F on tray, not only to nurture the idea, but to raise your hands to answer the question that Almighty Monica couldn't answer. Do you know why no one raised their hands even when they knew the answer? Do you? Good. That's because no one will dare do that knowing fully well the consequences that follows. Lisa, give me the knife. I'm, I'm really sorry. Please don't hurt me. I didn't know anything about it. Please, just, just, just have mercy, please. I'm the only child of my widowed mother. Hmm. Please see her. Oh, because God. of you, Mrs. Nico <laughs> called me a dummy. I didn't mean for that. I, was, I, didn't, I didn't have, I, I had no idea. I'm sorry. You would have thought about that before making me a laughing stock in the class. <laughs> oh, I forgot. She's a new student, right? Yes, she's a new student. Your offense is pardonable because you haven't gotten used to the way things happen around here. Yes, thank you. Thank you. But sin against Monica goes unpunished. Lisa, take off her clothes this minute. What? No, please. Remove her shirt. Keep quiet. Lisa, you have to be fast. Take it off. Stop! The next time anything synonymous happens again, I will not only strip you naked completely. I will also make sure that your poor widowed mother be childless. Now, nah. run away from here. Now, nah, oh, you lost. Get out. Fool. Wait, ah. They just snap this girl now. Ah. How person go not get finished? Get go run, leave her school uniform. Eh? I the come. If I say she not wear pint, oh, I bet she don't run, leave pint. Hiding. 
Hold on. Where's your school uniform? Please just go. Go! Oh, are, are you here to strip me completely naked? This, I, look, listen, I don't know what you're talking about. But, trust me, I want to help. Hi, dear Nat. Good morning. Good morning. Um, I'm fine. Thank you very much for yesterday. Mm -hmm. I, I, I sincerely wouldn't have known what to do without you. Thank you very, very much. I really appreciate it. It's fine. God bless you. It's fine. It's okay. Thank you. Um, what actually happened to your school uniform shirt? Um, it's your. Um. No. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay. What's going on? Um, Monica, mm -hmm. I saw Queen talking to your boyfriend earlier today. Which Queen is that? How many Queen do we have in this school? And with the way I saw them, I think she was telling him what we did to her the other day. What? Baby. I don't understand. Is there a reasonable reason for this? Don't believe any words that that wretched queen said to you because she's lying. What do you mean? Don't pretend she, she haven't told you I almost stripped her naked. I, I swear it was only her shirts I removed. Because I was angry she, she disgraced me in the class by answering the question I couldn't. Oh my god. Hold on. Are you trying to tell me? Wait. Were you the one that, so you the one that did that to her? Oh my god. Oh, you mean she didn't tell you anything? You know what? She didn't tell me anything. And thank you for revealing to me. Just take a look at you. You're just so dark-hearted. Listen, I'm giving you before closing hours. 
You better return that shit back to her, or else I will deal with you. Just get lost. I'm, I'm. Leonard! It. Hope I'm not in any form of trouble. The end of this meeting would determine that. Anita, I want you to do me a favor. What does the mighty Monica want from me? Do you know that thick forest called green poison? Green poison? Yes. I know it. Hmm. The forest that no one there crossed. News have it that lots of dead bodies are there. And no one have ever been there because a lot of people fear the forest. Good. I'm glad you know about that place so much. I will be there waiting after school hours. I want you to bring Queen to us. What do you want to do with her? Anita, that is none of your business. I can't do it. Remember, your dream was to join our clique. The clique of big girls. Hi, good morning. What is it? My name is Anita. I'm a new student. I'm also in your class. I've been watching you guys for a little while now and I would love to join your group. <laughs> <laughs> um, sorry, no, what did you just say? I said I... Say said that one more time. I it. A local trap like you wants to join the clique of the big girls. Let this be the first and last time that you will walk up to us to spew this nonsense. Fool. Lisa, let's go. This is your time to make your long-term dream come true. But if you decline this offer, you would be the one who would be lost in that forest for the rest of your miserable life. Not be seen or heard of again. You know, I don't make empty threats. Because my mom sent me an errand. Oh, okay, let's go. Yeah, Queen. 
Hey, what's up? Yeah, Queen, how are you doing now? I'm fine. I saw the way you were nodding in agreement in the chemistry class. It felt as though you, you were understanding the teaching. Yeah, yeah, yes, I understood it perfectly well. Thank God. You know why? I, I didn't understand a thing. It just felt as if she was speaking Swahili and <laughs> Chinese. I don't how, understand. How will you understand? And the only thing you do is just to read the Bible. Ah, that was really harsh, Anita. Listen, Anita. The word of God is life and power. Now, what are mortals without life? Forever. Oh. Okay, so since we're heading the same way, I'll just explain it to you on oh. our way home. Perfect. Perfect. No, 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 no. <laughs> Queen, I disagree with that. This boy called Donald is not going with us. But why? He's not going with us. That's it. Because I don't want someone to be preaching, 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 preaching. As you can see, the sun is already hot. Donald, you're not going with us. Don't mind her. Let's go. So, you know, when Anita, what useless storm did you pull yesterday? I'm sorry, it's not my fault. Then whose fault is it? You wanted to ruin our plan, that was why you tag alongside with Zonad. You taught him our plan, didn't you? God forbid, I didn't. Zonad insisted to go with us, that is it. Then we have to execute plan B. You better don't screw things up this time. Plan B? What? I got you something. What? Uh-huh. I know you like it. Ta -da -da -da. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, I'm really hungry. Thank God you got me this. Yeah. Hi. What are you doing now? Oh. Actually, Hi, I actually got you a little something. Really? I figured you'd be hungry and I got you your favorite fanta oh. and this. Thank you very much. Um, Anita already bought me snacks. But no okay. problem. I guess you understand. Anita, just have this one and eat it. Like, let's eat both eat snacks. Anita, I'll just I accept this one. You're never giving me anything. You understand, yeah? <laughs> You're not angry. <laughs> No, 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 why would I? Well, why would I be angry? No, I won't be angry, sorry. <laughs> no. Right. Do you know where? Oh. When I went to get these snacks, yeah, mm -hmm. I saw Mr. Felix in the supermarket. He was like, I should buy for him too. I was so surprised. Why would you buy for him? Like a teacher that hungry. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you know when they were sitting in the classroom? Okay. That time when I coughed, you didn't even notice what happened. I was trying to show you. When uh, Miss Nicole shouted at me, she to show you how He's getting can go see. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much for this class. Thank you. Come, let's eat it together now. No, I think I need to go to the school library, yeah? Okay. I'll well, come well. when I'm done. Okay. Yeah, I want well. to check out the book like that. Okay, thank All right, you. Bye then, take care of you. Okay, okay bye. Drink your fanta. Thank you. <laughs> Alice, are you not taking this? Don't misunderstand me. Just let's go eat the snacks. <laughs> okay, no problem if you say so, but I'm giving you this from the depth of my heart. Or you can take it home later when you eat it at home or something. Don't worry. Let's just cheers. Let's enjoy. Like, enjoy biscuits, biscuits, Fanta, <laughs> Sprite. 
I've, I've, I've eaten. Mm. I, I bought it for you. Okay, now. Don't worry. I'm you you have that your small sister. I like her. Maybe you can just give it to her. Better. Ah, you're better. <laughs> I'll give it to you. How did it go? It didn't go well. What do you mean it didn't go well? I gave Queen this nurse and the drink we poisoned. When she was about eating, Donald came in with his own drink. And that was her favorite. And she abandoned my I take his. <sighs> Shit. Why is it that this Donald boy has decided to be a tone on my flesh? I don't know. Shut up, you incompetent fool. Little job you can't execute. I'm so sorry I couldn't do the job, but I promise I'm gonna do better. Please. Okay? Okay, guys. Please. Am I not a member of the clip? Get out of here! Leave! This was so close. Just this little thing. I need to do it. Good morning, Christopher. Good morning, Ma. You all are welcome to SSD class. Good morning, students. You could have your seats. <laughs> have there been any teacher in this class today? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's our English, English teacher. teacher. You're the English teacher. Yes, sir. That's good. You guys are doing well. All right, um, class. I bring you good news. I should hear you smile or something. So excited. <laughs> All right, this is to inform you guys, the entire class, that our physical health education discussion will be coming up next week. Wow! Are you okay? Please note that um, for you to be part of this excursion, you'll be paying the sum of 10,000 Naira only. It's not compulsory, but the 10,000 Naira is for your welfare. Yeah. You know, you have to eat, get yourself, you know. And at the end of it, this excursion will be used as part of your continuous education assessment. <laughs> All right? Are we good? Yes, sir. All right. In case you have any questions, reach out to the secretary or better still, Miss Nicole here. Please. I believe you'll be able to. All right? All right, I'll see you guys later. Okay. Okay. Have a nice day. Have you too. All right, class. Have a nice day. You too, ma'am. Now, this is what we are talking about. This excursion just made my job easier. I don't understand. What are you talking? Monica, why did you say that? I know Anita is dumb, but not you, Lisa. How do you mean? Okay. If I kill her as the excursion ground, no finger will hurt her to me. It will appear as though it was an accident. Wow, oh, bravo. And you're so smart. What is it? Why are you developing cold feet all of a sudden? I'm so sorry, just that I feel so sorry for my friend. So you still consider that wretched student as a friend? Seems you have forgotten you are now in this circle. And if you ever think of backing out, you will be long dead before her. But what if she don't have 10,000 to pay for the excursion? I'm ready to pay for her, just to end the love of Lona at back. We need to leave.
had already told you guys. This might seem as a form of tourism and fun for some of you. But it is more than that. The excursion exercise will determine what you will score in your continuous assessment, which directly affects your exams and grade. So I would advise you buckle up and take it serious. But for now, you can hang around and rest. So, do you understand? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma Thank you. Sir, you can. Donut. Donut. Donut! Wait, 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 yes! Queen! Queen, you scared me! Oh my god! Are you okay? What is wrong with you since we got here? You've been acting all weird. Queen, there is something strange about this place. Immediately I stepped my foot in here. It feels as though there is a there is a strange spirit, a strange presence around here. I feel as though there is, there is a restless spirit that is that is just hovering around the whole place. Can't you feel it? No. <sighs> okay, why not tell me about this your spirit something? Why are you the only one feeling it, seeing it and catching it? What is wrong with you? Queen, I can't just... I can't lay my hand on the exact thing, but... Something don't just sit right about this whole place. And I can feel it! Ha! Uh, do, you, do you watch a horror movie last night? What do you mean, Queen? I can feel this, this is strange aura. It's this okay strange... now, you're making me scared. What? Strange aura, spirits, calm down. Those things does not exist. Ha! Let's go, come, let's go. Oh, yes, of course, let's... Let's join the others, yeah? Mm -hmm. Let's... What do you want again? Queen, I love you so much. Please, try and understand. I can't bottle this up anymore. That's, I just have to speak out, please. Bro, well, that's inconsequential right now. You know, please, if you were just listening to me, please just stay away from me. Please. Queen. How has the almighty fallen? What do you mean? Leonard, instead of you to stay close to me, so we can show the entire class that we are a couple, even outside the school premises, here you are, making nuisance of yourself with a common scholarship student. And how is that your business? Aren't you ashamed? Please excuse me. Leonard! So guys, I will group you all in pairs of three. You would go around the various sports sections, acquit yourselves with the names, use and working principles of all the sports equipment and other sections too. So having said that, Monica, Lisa, and Queen will be in the same group.
How did you get here? Who are you? I'm asking you a question. I say, who are you? Dona, who are you talking to? <laughs> you tell me who are you? Can't you see this, this little girl standing here? I say, who are you? Immediately I stepped into this excursion compound, I felt, I felt a strange aura, like a strange presence. And not quite long, I saw a little girl who vanished in my very before. Like, it, I saw her and she just disappeared. <sighs> what nonsense are you talking about? I am not talking nonsense. I speak of the truth. Please, what I'm advising is that let's just discontinue with this excursion thing. Let every student go home because this place is no longer safe. And the lives of the students are at stake. Please. I can see that you are out of your mind. Now, if you do not leave this place this minute, you will not only get severely punished, but I will make sure you get expelled from this school. Ma, you don't understand it. Now leave this place and join the others! I wanted to... I said leave! Yes. I'm so sorry. So, your man never tell you, say, make you know, come with adult the peace. Eh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, move. Oh, yeah. Are you running to your natural drunkard? Mom, as you can see, I just see spirits. Exactly! I am sure you must have seen a spirit alcohol and drank it. Mom, see, as I tell you so. Shut up and get lost. I said get lost! Mom. Mom, I just leave! I said leave! What is wrong with everybody? Ghost, 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 he even wants to run outside. How did this natural drunkard manage to get into Emirat International College? Oh my god! Anita! Leave there at once! Everybody is just crazy. Monica, please don't do this to me. Lisa, please let me beg her. I'm the only... I'm the only daughter of my widowed mother. Please don't do this to me. In your next life, that's if you've been lucky enough to come to this world again, you will avoid any man called Leonard. Especially when he's a boyfriend to someone called Monica. Monica!
What just happened? Like, how did she manage to to do that? Huh? You need to calm down. How will I know when we both landed helplessly on the ground? That queen is a witch. And I will not suffer a witch to live. I must kill her. Because it's obvious she has bewitched my man, Leonard. You're right. I need to do something. Anita. Yeah? What's happening here? We, we, we were actually exercising and got really exhausted. That, that's all. Exercise. Yes, exercise. Yes, exercising. Really? Yes. Okay, no problem. I'm gonna take my leave. See you guys. I'm scared. Go to the room. Go this way. No, she's there. Are you sure? Is this what's going on? Okay, fine. You had the F on tray, not only to nurture the idea, but to raise your hands to answer the question that all my team Monica couldn't answer. Do you know why no one raised their hands even when they knew the answer? Do you? Good. That's because no one will dare do that, knowing full well the consequences that follows. Lisa, give me the knife. I'm really sorry. Please, don't hurt me. I didn't know anything about it. Please, just, just, just have mercy. Please, I'm the only child of my widowed mother. Hmm. Please see her. Oh, because God. of you, Mrs. Nicole <laughs> called me and told me. I have no idea. I'm sorry. You would have thought about that before making me a laughing stock in the class. <laughs> oh! I forgot. She's a new student, right? Yes, she's a new student. Your offense is pardonable because you haven't gotten used to the way things happen around here. Yes, thank you. Thank you. But seeing against Monica goes unpunished. Lisa, take off her clothes this minute. What? No, please. Remove her shirt. Hiding. Hold on. Where's your school uniform? Please just go. Go. Oh, are, are you here to strip me completely naked? This, I, look, listen. I don't know what you're talking about, but trust me, I want to help.
Monica, please don't do this to me. Lisa, please let me beg her. I'm the only... I'm the only daughter of my widowed mother. Don't do this to me. In your next life, that's if you be lucky enough to come to this world again. You will avoid any man called Leonard. What are you doing here all alone? When your fellow students are in their groups doing the activities. Queen, friendship is like hiding beneath a tree whose flower shades you from the scorching sun. But a bad friend uproots the roots of the tree, leaving you to burn under the sun rays. Queen. I don't understand what you're talking about. What are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be with other students? <sighs> are you out of your mind? How dare you mute me when I am still talking to you? <sighs> you know I can punish you severely, right? If we are to be punished by every of our wrongdoings, I'm sure you'll be burning in the deepest part of hell by now. What? You heard me. You had an illicit affair with a male student. And was caught by a female student. You hired some boys to vape her on her way back from school just to cover up your evil deed. She got pregnant and was expelled from the school. She committed suicide because she couldn't bear the shame. And I'm sure you have no idea that she's dead by now. How did, how did you know about this? You, Mrs. Nicole, you will stand and watch the consequence of your actions meet you pretty soon. What did you say you urgently want to tell me? Yes. You know, I, I told you that that I felt a negative aura. Immediately I stepped my foot in this discussion grounds. Remember I told you? Yes, yes, you did. You Good. did tell me. Good. I saw Queen today and it felt as though that presence was standing right in front of me. 
I could feel it like she was standing, staring right into my face and it felt as though she's... Hey, hold on. What are you talking about? Are you telling me what I'm talking about? I'm telling you that I think, I think Queen has been possessed by an evil spirit. Yes, that, that's the only explanation to this because... Donald, what? you know what? I guess you're down with low fever. Why will you say that? Yes. You know, I don't just because I don't just see things like that. I, yeah, 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 I could feel it. What are you talking about? Why will you, what? Queen is not a spirit. Listen, Why will you say she's possessed? You don't understand it. This spirit is not just an ordinary spirit. It's, I can feel it. Something very powerful emanating from high. I can't just lay my hands on it. Something I could I could you, literally you know, see. Listen, listen, you know what? Please, we'll talk later, okay? I don't I'm not in for all this shit, please. Leonard, if nobody believes me, I think you're supposed to believe me now. <sighs> Leonard. Um, so we have come to the to the big sorry, we have come to the end of this excursion. Excursion, yes. I believe we all, um, we all learned something. Yes, yes ma'am. Ma okay, so. So, we'll be leaving, okay? Let's go. Do you have any idea when Miss Neko was behaving strange? How am I supposed to know? Isn't it the both of us that were standing before her? But it clearly seems as if she's uncomfortable and scared of something. That's my point. She's acting very, very strange. What could that be? That's none of my business. Please, let's go. Queen, are you okay? Is everything okay? You've been acting strange since we came back from the excursion. Hope you're fine. I guess Donald is right. Does it mean does it mean she's possessed? No.
Nicole, yeah. what just happened there? <sighs> Sir, it appears that a witch is at Mistos. What are you talking about? The school gets just closed on its own. A student is dead. And you're telling me about a witch. Do you know what this will do to the reputation of this school? Reputation? <laughs> So please, we need to think about our lives first before we bother ourselves with this core reputation. Nicole! Yes! Oh Miss Nicole! Ah! You would walk around the surface of the earth and tell to those who cares and those who doesn't on how you ended the life of a student. Nicole! Oh, what is she talking about? <laughs> I had an illicit affair with a mess student. Really? Yes! Really! And when another student discovered Yes, boys, to rip her so she could get pregnant and expelled. <laughs> yes! Nicole! Miss Nicole had an illicit affair with a male student. <laughs> oh. I had an affair! <laughs> I had an affair! <laughs> I never knew she's this evil. She's evil just like you. And for every blood you've swept under the school carpet, you will surely get your reward. Wait for my return. Ah! Principal! I'm going to do this again! What? No, 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 no! I'm going to do this again! Nicole! 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 Every girl you mothered just because of Leonard, who doesn't feel anything synonymous to love for you. Monica, you will pay with your very own blood. And as for you, Lisa, you came from a decent home but decided to join a bad clique. Just as well among and be what you weren't. It's a pity that your consequence came pretty much sooner. I will change. I will change, baby. I will change.